I'm forever blowing bubbles. Yes, guys. Finally, we have made it to the friendlies on manager mode. Miss a video game man here, and we are going to be playing our first friendly. Now, I do admit that last video I said we were going to have two friendlies in this one, but I did change my mind when I was editing it because I thought, you know what? This is the first game that we are managing. This is the first gameplay on my channel. This should be something special. So I gave a little bit of a longer edit to it. I wish I could say that the video um, is going to be an, an epic video where we win like 11, 12 nil. Unfortunately, things didn't go that way. I have quickly discovered that this West Ham side is not a great side. Their defence is atrocious to start with. And quite frankly, their midfield isn't that great either. I had Song playing because he's an 80 rated player. He's the highest rated player for West Ham, albeit he is on loan. But he was nowhere here. He was abysmal. I, I cannot underestimate how slow he felt and how just he just didn't break any of the play up. They just ran through onto our defence time after time. And that meant that our defence just couldn't handle it. And our defence just wasn't very good at all at, at defending or tackling. This is the one chance that we did get, one major chance that we got. Cresswell running down the wing. And Cresswell's pace is decent. I have to give him that. He gets down, he crosses in, Andy Carroll's there, I'm thinking goal. Andy Carroll messed it up. But then worse than that, Andy Carroll stays on the floor and he is injured. He is out of the game. We have to substitute him off. And at this point I'm thinking, I could have sold you. You were there for that very reason to get on the end, score goals. You didn't score a goal with your head. And not only that, you got injured. I mean, he got bashed in the face there, but I'm not sure how he hurt his leg from that. We'll have to wait and see what the physio says, see if it's going to be long term. I'm hoping not. I'm hoping that he's going to be okay. We brought Valencia on, and it didn't really seem to make much of a difference. The pace of Valencia could be decent, but he's not really the same sort of player as, as Carroll. He's not going to dominate as much in the header. And then at the 45th minute, guys, Alton top. Right at the end of a decent move, um, I mean, they just walk through the defence, to be honest. And there's some 45th minute cheese there. Just right on the stroke of our time. I mean, look how easy it is. The defence is all over the place. Adrian had no chance, and that is popped right into the corner. Side-footed. And there's confirmation. Alton top, 45th minute, and I was worried. We'd lost Carroll. Our defence was rubbish. I thought, well, let's go for some attacking play. Let's try and outscore them. If they're going to score goals, let's try and get some goals. Let's get some positives out of this game. The male comes down the wing, and that's a poor cross. And that's pretty much all that happened in the first half. I, I don't think we had a shot on target, to be fair. Second half, they make some substitutions. I keep the team as it was. I want to try and learn something out of the players that I thought were the best players in the team. If this is the best players in the team, we are in trouble. Uh, because you'll see here, they just carry on attacking. I mean, this is straight from kickoff. They're coming through, and we had to get a last-ditch tackle in there, or they were in behind us. We do get a chance here, though. The, the ball is played through, and it goes into the middle. And I'm thinking this could be quite good. This is a good move. We've started to move the ball around a little bit. They close us down right as I shoot, and I mean, that's a shot. It's not on target, but it's a shot. We go into the corners, because I'm trying to figure out the, the new set-piece tactics. Um, trying to round with them. I, I think I'm probably going to leave them as default, because I, I don't really get them. You can see this corner is just absolutely abysmal. We do challenge, though. Tompkins did do quite well. Out to Noble. Noble cutting inside, and then Whammo! Completely taken out. The ref points to the penalty spot. Rightly so. I, mean, I have no idea what was going on there. It's a yellow card only because there's so many players back. Because look at this. The ball's not even there. And bam! He is taken out. He is hit. He had no idea what was going on. Like a bus hit him. He gets up, dusts himself off. And he's going to stand up and take this penalty. The captain going to try and score the first goal for West Ham under the new regime. They're trying a little bit of cheese tactics by doing a substitution right as he's about to take the penalty. But Noble steps up. 
He's feeling the pressure, but can he live with it? Can he put the ball in the back of the net and get West Ham's season up and running? Yes, he can. Noble with the first goal of the Mr. Video Game Man era. Everyone will remember this moment. The first of many goals. Everyone is ecstatic. Look at the crowd. They cannot believe it. Finally, we scored. It doesn't matter if it's from a penalty. I think that this was probably the first shot on target that we had. Didn't have very many in the game, guys. Um, I mean, we had a few shots, but they were all off target. This one probably the first one, and it went in. I mean, the keeper was very close to it. It was pretty lucky. And even Adrian is happy. Probably put in a little bit too many um, clips of that penalty. But I was excited. I was ecstatic. I thought things were going to change now. We have got the upper hand. We've scored. We've got momentum on our side. And we could go on and win this. You see, straight from kickoff, they gave the ball away. I was happy. But no. They kept coming at us. And uh, I was wondering when we were going to concede again. Because you see, all the balls were just clearing it off the line. Last ditch tackles, last ditch clearances. They were coming at us and at us. Look at that, right behind. And Adrian has to go down low to save it there. And it was so easy for them to get in behind us. Make a few changes up front. Bring on Carlton Cole. Just trying to, to see which of my strikers would be the best to use if Carroll's out for a long time. Because I don't really know what we're going to do if Carroll's out. He was my game plan. Cross it in, head it in. See, they get a corner here. And there's another last-ditch tackle. Trying to clear the ball uh, away. And eventually we get it out. But then Noble gives it away again. They come through. I mean, this was all of the game. They were constantly on us. And oh, that was so close. And I'm starting to wonder if I picked the right difficulty. Maybe legendary is too much. Maybe West Ham just aren't good enough for me to successfully win on legendary. And look at that fantastic save. And now I think we're going to counter and give away a, a free kick. You know, that's professional. Gets himself a yellow card. But, but maybe, guys, maybe legendary is going to be that little bit too difficult. We'll see. We're getting to the end of the game now. 85th minute. And we get a chance. We get a chance. And I'm thinking I'm going to score. And then from behind, we get another penalty. Another one, guys. And a straight red. And I really thought that I was going to score. Ho Jong Ho knew it as well, and he took our player down, took him out. I mean, this is cynical, right from behind, straight through the back, deserves a red card. And we get another penalty, five minutes from time, and I cannot believe it. I think we are going to win this game. We are going to steal it, guys. Noble's going to step up again. He scored the first. He's confident. Which way does he go? Does he go the same way? Does he... To go the other way, what's the keeper thinking? It's tricky, the second penalty is always tricky. He goes the same way and oh my god! The keeper saves it guys, the keeper saves it. It's the 89th minute, the keeper saves it and I thought that was going to be our crowning glory. It's probably only the second shot we've had on target to be fair. But I really thought that we were going to score. Right at the death here, we get a free kick. Another yellow card comes out. And that was just cynical. I mean, they're all over the place. We, we've got the extra man, but unfortunately, only for a, a short period of time. And I make a little bit of a mistake here, guys. I should have shot. I should have gone for, for a straight free kick in there. I try and cross it in. I get it all wrong. Keeper collects that easy. And that's pretty much going to be the end. I'm going to end uh, one all. Spoilers. Um, but yeah, I mean, once we get our defence sorted, hopefully we'll be a, a little bit better off. Um, but anyway, that's going to be the end of the video, guys. It's going to end one all. If you like this video, smash a like on it. Subscribe for more content. We're going to have the next two friendlies coming out in the very soon future. Until then, keep showing your support. Keep putting stuff in the comments. And I will see you next time.